Over the years, Rameshwaram has grown in importance by drawing millions of pilgrims each year. While its connectivity to the mainland via the Pamban Bridge remains crucial for its accessibility. The Pamban Bridge stood as an engineering marvel, connecting Rameshwaram to the mainland since its construction in 1914. For generations, it has been a crucial lifeline for the people of India, connecting them to various tourist spots. However, after 105 years of service, the bridge succumbed to time and corrosion and was closed in December 2022, signalling the end of an era. But now a new chapter begins with the introduction of India's first vertical lift railway sea bridge. This state-of-the-art structure, stretching 2.10 kilometres with a 72-metre vertical lift span, is designed to revolutionise travel. The new Pamban Railway Bridge will allow trains to run smoothly at speeds of up to 80 km per hour, while its unique vertical lift design will enable it to rise and let ships pass beneath when there is no rail traffic. With a construction cost of 535 crore rupees and five years of meticulous work, this modern marvel will soon link Mandapam to Rameshwaram, providing a quicker, more efficient route for pilgrims travelling to the sacred Ramanatha Swami temple. This bridge has got broad gauge track on it and is electrified. The latest technology has been used. The centre portion which lifts up vertically has got latest technology. It is energy efficient and it is manpower intensive. This bridge itself, uh, I already told it is the world's second and India's first bridge. This itself attracts a lot of um, tourists apart from the pilgrimage uh, kind of tourist. Uh, to ensure the train safety, the bridge vertical movement is interlocked with the signals of the Pamban station. By offering a seamless combination of rail and maritime passage, the new Pamban bridge is poised to transform how people travel and redefine regional connectivity, making the journey smoother and faster for everyone.